Hi everybody, it's uh, Friday evening. It's 5.35ish in the evening and um, I made dinner and um, if you are listening um, apartment prepper, we um, I bought a um, stir fry veggie mix from Walmart and you were saying that you wanted to get it but it was sold out. You dodged a bullet there because when you cook it, well, when I cooked it, it kind of turned sloppy. And, the, you know, when I want to stir fry, I kind of, you know, I don't want my veggies underdone. But I don't want them to be mush either. <laughs> you know what I mean? Anyway, the rest of you, welcome, welcome. <laughs> um, my name is Kendra, and this is my channel. And today I just have a kind of a short, um, you know, not much going on here really. Except that it's not hot today. It's muggy. The sun has gone in the clouds. The clouds have covered the sun, <laughs> and um, so it's not a, a hot, hot day. Easier on the flowers, and I got a, a delivery from uh, Amazon. And so I don't know if any of you have seen these before, but I just found them myself. It's Chef Boyardee Pasta and Cheese Flavored Sauce Mac and Cheese. Dig that. 350 calories. Is that for how many servings? How many servings is this? Well, you know, it's serving size, one can. It is macaroni and cheese. I don't know what I was expecting. So 12.22 is the expiration on the one can that I did look at. Um, and that's not terrible, but I would like to have had it been 23, 22, 23, 24. And maybe it's because it's a dairy base, you know? I mean, if it is in fact dairy based. And I wasn't looking at the packaging date this time. I actually best buy dated it. <laughs> One thing I did want to say, this can's in great condition, and I believe the reason for that is each individual, and I only got four because that was all they would allow me to have. It said, um, purchase, per anyway, it said only allowed four. So, and it says new item on it. So look at this, bubble wrapped the entire thing on all four of them. Awesome sauce. And also, I got my first set of mylar bags and um, are they called incandescent? No, that's not what they're called. What are they called? You know the oxygen things? <sighs> Let me see if I can see it on 40 variety bags. So I've got 100 bags total. Um, made in China. Uh oh. Hi. Um, so I was hoping that my little um, oxygen things would not be made in China because I have heard that they're best made here and you can get them made here. I'm wondering if I'm even going to keep these. They came with labels and everything. So, oh well. Um, I'm not sure what to do on that. What do you guys think about that? If the um, little oxygen remover packages are actually made in China, are they going to be any, you know, I remember years and years ago, I got a little container, well, it's kind of a big container, it was like a plastic container of decorative rocks, and I was going to do something artistic with these rocks, and so dumped them out, you know, going through and picking out the right size, and there was a cigar cigarette butt in with the rocks and had Chinese writing on it. And I thought, well, they're just rocks. It's not that big a deal. It's weird, but it's not that big a deal. And I worry about things, you know, a little bit. So anyway, that's my story. And that's all I have for today. And um, I will show, no, I'm going to show you right now. They're not done, but I'm going to show you. Okay, now remember on this half, I have um, just a mess because it has to be redone all the time because there's so much in it. Well, <laughs> I, the other half was just a closet. My husband made these beautiful shelves. So I've got one, two, three, five, four, five. <laughs> and then the bottom where I can put something else. I don't know what. But these are the jars that I got at the garage sale. I washed them up, cleaned them up, put labels on them. I don't have anything in them yet, but I will. And I'm going to put... I'm going to try to put all dairy here and um, all coffee stuff here. I just don't know. I, we'll see. <laughs> I am so happy to have this space. I know you preppers know. When you get a new space, you're all about it. <laughs> I've seen you guys. <laughs> but anyway, I'm thrilled with what he did for me. 
and um, that will be it for the night. And if you like this kind of thing, just, you know, like prepper stuff, but that's not all I do. But, you know, I guess somebody said I blog. I do day in the life. I, I'm not sure what blog stands for. I need to look that up. Thank you for stopping by, and I hope that if you like what you see, you'll give me a thumbs up, maybe give a comment, or even think about subscribing because I love new friends and old friends too. Bye-bye.